what's up you guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl mahogany and i'm glowing okay but um okay so you guys i know it's been like a minute basically two months because it's the end of um january let me breathe a little hold on okay so i want to tell you guys basically where i've been and what was going on so first of all um december i had started making some videos but i had got like really discouraged or what is the word unmotivated i got really unmotivated so i was like okay let me take december off and like recuperate myself but to be honest once january hit i was hit with other stressors as well so that really you know those two months just wasn't like the best months for me so um yeah but i want to give you guys like a little testimony because as you can see by the title it is new year new blessings and i have been blessed so i want to give a little testimony and then tell you guys you know the blessings that i have so um i moved out to arizona in may of 2020 and when i got down here i thought that you know I'm gonna get a job like this because I'm a CNA, you know, CNAs, medical field people are needed. I thought I was gonna get a job. No, when you move to a different state, you have to get on the, like the registry, everything, you gotta pay for that. I had money when I came here, but I didn't have, you know, enough money that would have got me through the time that I didn't have a job. And plus I was helping other people out and giving money away and I didn't even know you know what i was finna go through um myself so anyway i come down here when i'm finna get a job da, da, da. nope i gotta get on the registry i gotta get a you know new cpr card all the other stuff so i was really discouraged when i first came down here because one i was in class and so that was a little stressful but um like you had to pay for well you had to pay to get on the registry and all that but like it was more difficult trying to figure out how to uh, applied to get on the registry if that makes sense it took me a while like i just wasn't i don't know i wasn't ready to stress myself out trying to figure out how do i get on the registry you know so anyway i could have found a regular job but i didn't want to work somewhere where i'll be making less money and i could work with my cna and make more more money that makes sense so anyway it was a lot of factors that was going into like um, me getting a job I think it was maybe in September remember May to September but I did take a break from like the end of July to the end of August so like a month break or whatever um so anyway I found a job in like September and it was a home health care job I had applied to hospitals and it wasn't hiring and everything so anyways I applied to I got a job there we go period okay <laughs> so i had got a job but my availability was like ew. okay like i had to help i would help babysit and stuff like that and also i don't have my own car out here so it's like i got to work around other people's schedules so that was like not you know how can i get a job when i have all these things that's coinciding with each other so anyway she was, um, it's a home health care job, so she was looking for clients for me that would fit my availability, but I never, that never happened. So eventually, a, cu a couple more months of being stressed and being broke and <laughs> depressed, um, I finally found a job. No, I told myself, I told myself, Mahogany, we not finna be broke. Like, it's getting, I can't be broke. So I uh, went and applied to a couple jobs. I applied for like Ross, you know um tj maxx home goods bath and body works jobs like that like it's not my cna but it's like at this point honey we can't be we not finna be broke okay so anyway i was calling ross like every monday because they would tell me call next week call next week da, da, da. i would call every monday they didn't have no positions filled um i think i called tj maxx i don't know but i really didn't want to work out home goods because it's like about furniture and it's not like about clothes or whatever but i was like let me call them because your girl need a job 
So anyway, I called them and it was like, can you come in for an interview? Da, da, da. I'm like, yes. And keep in mind, it's in December. Remember, May to December. Oh, I was broke. <laughs> so anyway, um, obviously, I mean, not obviously, well, yeah, obviously I got the job. So that's blessing number one. Um, I first didn't know how I feel about the job. But I actually like the job. Like, girl, I be, girl, boy, whatever. I be in there um, looking at the furniture, scouting out what I'm going to buy for myself. And, like, I don't know. The people are nice. And primarily all the people at all the jobs that I've been at have been nice, you know. So I like it there. Sometimes I call in. They let me come in. So it's a good job. And, yeah. So, anyway, um, January rolling around. I've been working at... Um, home goods for like a week or whatever so um i was still like trying to get a second job because i have like i had these big plans for my birthday and you know whatever and i wasn't finna play it but like i was trying to go all out for my birthday and i was planning today i'm saving up now but um so anyway i'm like okay i want to find a cna job i had applied to a nearby hospital but and i was supposed to call them and uh check in with call and check in and see if they see my application or whatever but I never did that because I was talking to my mom and she worked at a prison so she was like why don't you apply to the prison so I applied to the prison and within two days they called me back so then after that like um when they called me it was like I already had the job they was asking like what position did I want tell me how much I would make da 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 and then they told me I'll have an interview um this day and then when I went to the interview um it wasn't more it wasn't really like an interview they probably asked me like two questions like interview questions and everything else is telling me like about the job like i got the job you know so i got the job that job so that's blessing number two um so um wait where was i going so that's blessing number two and i'm i filled out the whole paperwork uh i filled out all the paperwork and I should be starting that job soon, but I'm so happy because they pay good, and I'm two jobs, shawty, and I'm finna get this money, period. So, yeah, and um, this is another blessing, but it's not like a job type of thing, but I was, like I said, I was like really unmotivated and unmotivation, um, unmotivating energy kind of um, go hand in hand with being depressed, I guess, but I was really stressed out this month, and I feel like what was really stressing me out is over and I did a lot of self-reflecting and like, I don't know, the blessing is just basically me coming to my senses and I know what I'm doing for this year. So, um, basically, yes, that's where I've been in the last two months, but I'm finna get the ball back rolling, you know, and I got some really good videos coming next. So, yeah, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you liked the video, please leave a like. And if you like me, please subscribe. Other than that, see you guys next time. Bye!